Welcome back, my dark means to the vo uh to my to the void. Sorry, I've been using Darkino a lot. Also, I just barely woke up. But I'm actually pretty tired right now. I'm not joking. Ugh, but before I begin, as you've noticed, I'm sorry that we're starting here. Now, just to let you know. Yeah, I got not the fans here, but just to let you know if you have not seen the first video, watch it because that has a long version of my warning. Which I give you enough time to leave. I'm not joking. I literally give you. I think it's like four or five minutes long, even longer than the previous one, which gives you a lot. So I'm just gonna give you the short version, and before we begin, all right? And like I said, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm like freaking sleepy right now. I literally just woke up. It's like I wake up late in the afternoon. That's who I am. I don't wake up in the mornings. If I did, I would be putting out videos all day. <laughs> Not really, but whatever. Like, listen. Like, here is the short version of all the, of the of the of the warning. Sorry. Yes. Eh. Uh, in. Eh. Uh, sorry. My brain is like still trying to get into place. All right. Here's the short version, which actually you got enough time anyway. Warning: If you have not heard of the Saga series, then be prepared because it's about girls showing off the bodies in spicy scenes. Censor it spicy scene, so you're not it's not gonna go over the line. Heck, it never goes over the line, it just shows the girls' bodies in spicy scenes, alright? Censored, right? Heck, it doesn't even go that far, alright? And if you can see the girl here, just get ready, alright? And if you're not into that, you can leave right right now. Don't blame me for what just happened. I ended the video last time and I gave you time in the last week to leave. So you don't so you didn't have to come back for the rest of the series, alright? But whatever. Here you go. I'm about to end it, and once I begin, it's on your heads, guys and gals. It's not my fault. After that, all right, ready and let us begin. All right. If you haven't seen the last video, please, it's uh, I will leave the link to the long version down below. But for, uh, but let's begin. I'll try to get my mind back in place during the video. But yeah, we're starting off with this, with this pretty girl here, who is also someone we met in, well. Uh, it's been a few weeks. I think we met uh, back a while ago. So let's begin. Oh, she fiddles with one of the cups on her chest. Oh my gosh. I don't know how it stays in place. I don't either. Haven't seen you in a while. How, how have you been, Koji? Right. It's been a long time. I'm alright. Currently studying university. I see. Doing well in your classes, right? Yeah, I chose that voice because she's more... She looks more monotone. Yeah, although I'm not really used to the big to a big city like this. It feels kind of em uh, empty in my apartment too. I know how you feel, like you're alone in the crowd. Even after all this time, Mitsubi knows me inside and out. Oh man, it's strange how some bonds seem never seem to never go away, even after years apart. Yeah, what about you, Itsumi? How did you end up as a bunny? Family moved here when I was going to high school. Then I just stuck around. Got a job at the ca at the cafe. A lot of cu of the customers know me now. So she's becoming fairly popular. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Just like how I was in middle school. I wish I could say I was up to great things, but this is pretty much it. Yeah, I really can see. She puts her index finger on my nose. You're thinking dirty thoughts again. That look, just like when you were a little boy. Hey, no telepathy! God dang, she's good! Don't I deserve the privacy of my own thoughts? She giggles a little. I missed you, Koji. I think you were my best friend. I missed you too, honestly. Ooh, best friend! Oh, so there was no... Oh, oh I feel sorry for Koji. It's a shame that you had to move away. I can't do much about that now, right? So let's just make up for lost time instead. I'd love to. Well, I work full time at the cafe, and I don't have my schedule for the next week yet. So we'll have to wait and see what time I have off. But you could come by the cafe sometime. Sure, I'd love to. Great, we need a part timer to help out. Oh! It's getting slammed every day. You can guess why. Right, working food retail during Christmas season. Yeah! Yeah, I feel the pain. I feel the pain to that as well. I have, I, like I've said, I, my job is basically fast food. 
I don't know. Yeah, fast food. Yeah, I'm just gonna call them all fast food. It doesn't really matter anymore. Yeah, and for some reason during the hol during the holidays or after holidays, before holidays, the, the place gets like slammed for some reason. If we're to drive there and the front and to the front line, well, barely in the front line because nobody can stay inside for that long anymore. But yeah, it's getting yeah. For some reason, I just say that nobody knows how to cook. I'm just saying, I'm sorry. If you know how to cook, good on you. But oh my gosh, I see the same people coming to work, coming to get food every day, and it just in Phil Wilderman. I know I'm ranting, but yeah, during the season, it gets really hectic for some reason. I guess people want some freaking food or something, and it's just, oh, a pain. Trust me, it gets so much. You have to run around a lot, and when, and sometimes when you're short-handed, oh my goodness, that gets out of control real fast. Trust me. Be careful what job you choose, all right? Unless you need a job badly. So be careful. Choose your jobs carefully, and but that doesn't mean you don't need to go to fast food. I'm just saying, choose your jobs carefully and see what works. All right, just try it out. All right. Heck, I'm still working at the same place for almost five years, six years. I can't remember how many years, but yeah, it's the but thanks to that job, it's the thing that helped me got get my stuff to be starting YouTube. So let's get you on. I wonder if that's what hell looks like. More than likely. But you'd be able to spend all day with me. So we'd kill two birds with one stone. Well, yeah, but... But it's not like old times, is it? I mean, I'd love to just hang out, but... They're depending on me to bring in customers. Right, I see. It's a shame, but... I guess that can't be helped. Oh, man, sad. Yeah, it's a shame. I can't help but feel disappointed. Even though she has her reasons. Dude, of course you should feel disappointed. You can't hang out with this bombshell of a girl right here who is wearing a literal buddy suit. I mean, what are the odds that we just run into each other again? And even if that happens, we probably won't be able to spend time together due to our hours. Don't worry about it. I'd be happy to help. It's a Tsumi, after all. I can't leave you to be eaten alive by your customers. Great. It's been really tough finding help. We've already gone through one. Is it really that bad? You'll understand once you've seen it. What the Christmas season does is... Traumatizing. Yes, it is! The, it's not, like I said, it's not just the Christmas season. It's the all the seasons. Depending on the season, it's literally... But for some... It's literally Christmas season and all the other seasons? Yeah! Anytime where food's involved, yeah. Even so, I won't give up. An old friend needs help, and I just can't turn her down. I probably may handle it. I probably can handle it since I already have experience in the fast food, but maybe she has a different profession? I don't know. Oh, she said cafe, right? Okay, I might have a different uh, thing. Gingerbread universe, dandelion, super candy. Huh. You're still as loyal as ever, too. So, university, you met someone yet? What do you mean? Oh, oh, Koji, shut up! A girl, maybe? Not really, no. Oh, I see. I'm... I have trouble talking with people. Unsurprising. Oh, and with Christmas too. The flies begin to crumple under tightening grip. Well, I'd like to have something to celebrate too. My parents aren't home this year, so the place is empty. I know the feeling. So, I'm really happy you're here, Koji. Oh, is she hitting on us? Oh, 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 thank you. I was promised a few days off soon, so we'll just have to wait until then. Oh, oh, oh! If we can't do anything on Christmas, well, we can still hang out sometime soon, just like old times. That would be nice. So, when can you start? My schedule is kind of empty, so tomorrow, I guess. Right. Anyway, I really need to get back to work. These flyers won't hand themselves out. If they did, it would be a perfect world, wouldn't it? Yep, it would. I still have to work during Christmas. She laughs weakly at her own joke. Here, take one of them. We could use your help anytime you have time to spare. Absolutely. See you then, Koji. Yeah, later, Tsumi. I wander off into the crowd. Oh my gosh, I, we got hit on. Oh my gosh. I never thought I'd see it, Tsumi again. You had some kind of... She, you had some kind of feeling for me a long time ago. What? Well, you better have gone out with her back then! 
I swear to free. I swear. Maybe they, what? But do you still have them after all these years? Now, considering what she just did. Yes, dude. What? You didn't go. Are you serious? You lost your chance back then? Man, you better take this ch chance now. Actually, the, actually, I will explain later on, all right? Some things change and some things remain the same. Considering how she acted toward me. Yeah, she probably still feels that way. Oh my gosh. Wait, Koji. Okay, first he knows, but he's smart enough to figure that out? Usually the main protagonist thinks... Oh no, she probably doesn't feel that way. What the heck? If she does, I don't know what to do. <laughs> but having people with me is better than being alone, right? I guess. Especially with the bunny girl. Also, depending how they compare, compare her to the bunny girl in the anime. She kind, they kind of look the same. Hmm. Eh. Sure is a strange day. Things just keep happening. Wonder if they'll stop. Either way, there's still plenty of daylight to kill. Oh, I said that. Oh, I said that. Oh, YouTube, please. That I did not mean to say that. Please. It's fairly late in the afternoon now. What a day it's been so far. First Akina, then I made it to me again. After all that, surely I won't run into anyone else. Ah, foreshadowing. Right? I mean, at least I'm not bored anymore. That's good, that's good. Yeah, just sitting around at home was the worst. Got to do something, anything, to break out of a rut. Trying to reach out helps. It's kind of corny, but it's true. Akina said sometimes if you do nice things, the world is listening. But I guess I'll just walk down the street. Whoa! Sorry, are you... Oh, my mouth dries us. Oh my gosh! Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh! Ah! Oh, what? Ah, something came out of my nose! Something came out of... Ah! No, it's not blood! Oh, okay, look at her! Look, it's a blonde girl with... It's a blonde girl with, um, with blue eyes, so nice, and I can't do anything to, to, to defend this. We need to move on fast. I seen that bumped into, um, a girl. Yeah, well, this certainly is a view. It is a view of those big blue eyes. I mean, those eyes are pretty good, I have to say. Why? Why is, I mean, yeah, it is the season for Corny Santa of its butt. Why so? I, I think that's supposed to be saying raunchy. I don't... I wouldn't expect this. Normally. Has the, the world just turned into some kind of... Uh, Smex comedy? Sorry, I got that for my... For my... For, for my... For my... For my... YouTube. I don't know what to say because... It's, it's there. I can't say it myself. Well, I should forget myself. Hey, you alright? Nope. No response. This is... um. Though she has a concussion. Okay, since the way she... Oh, I just tripped all, all over myself. Today's been so unlucky. I'm so very sorry for running into you. I'm gonna give her that voice because of the way she she is. In the face. <laughs> and the way she's falling over, I'm guessing it's, it's fine. But uh, maybe you should stand up. You're um, on display here. Eh? Eh? She tries to hop to her feet, but she only manages to stumble over. Yep, that's the voice I'm giving her. N no, stop looking! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Okay, okay, I won't! Though I find it hard to actually do what I promised. Yes, it is! It's right there! The view holds my eyes captive. It is also the shiny. It's very shiny. The sparkly, so nice and round. Yeah, the face! This elephant in her figure is perfectly hypnotizing. Then she starts up again, but slower this time. Moving on to her knees first, she doesn't seem to notice that her skirt is still too short for Pantsu, oh my gosh! Such an awful day! What am I going to do? She starts to sniffle. Hey, I didn't say anything, I swear! I don't want to make her cry. Everything's just gone wrong today. Eh, what do you mean? Kiss is going to be cancelled this year unless I do something, but I can't find it. Christmas, cancelled? Can't find it? What can't you find? My wand. I lost my wand. Your wand? What? She's a magical girl? Yes, I don't know where to look either. 
What's all this about a wand? Whatever it is, it seems important to her. I have to find it or Christmas will be- I have to find it or Christmas will be cancelled! I almost talked to the coach- Can we move this along, please? He just barely managed to hold back the tears. This is terrible. I don't know what to do. Uh, your pants are still showing. She flushes red as she glides down her, over her body. And then I told you to stop! Now she's up on her feet trying to force her skirt down. Anyway, please forget that you saw that. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! This is this. I'm gonna. Oh, th I'm assuming. I we both know who this is. The name. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! What kind of outfit is this? Whoo! Well, well, I uh, please help me. I know you're probably busy, but I need help badly. <clears throat> weekly at my sleeve. It's kind of pitiful. Oh, wait. Now everything makes sense. Of course she lost a part of her cosplay outfit, and she wants me to find it again. Can you help me find it? Please, please? I keep on asking you, but nobody wants to help. Sure, I'll help. Sorry about your cosplay prop. Cosplay? What is that? Isn't that what you're doing? No, no. Whatever it is, I'm Santa. Yeah, this is Santa! This is Santa! The... Ooh, I have to say, Santa, oh my gosh! Ooh, Santa, oh Santa. Ooh. I need to get my wand back so the Christmas happens on schedule. I almost threw my mouse off the side. I need to get a table sooner or later. I would, I would be sad if that happened. And all the children would be sad. And, and... Well, she doesn't break character for anything. And I guess I'll play long. What can it hurt? After the, do you know, after the Kitsuna, you would think that he would be thinking that this would be Santa. But, of course, you can't really expect someone to realize that, oh, it's, it's, oh, you play, you're Santa. No, he would think differently. Sure, Santa it is then. Okay then, Santa. I promise I'll help you find your one. For Christmas. He will? You really mean it? Of course, I can't disappoint all the kids out there. Yeah, do it for the kids! You can't let Santa this Christmas be over. Besides, those kids are lucky anyway. Oh, they're real lucky. They believe in Santa still. Whew. Oh, sorry, I was distracted by something. She leaves it to at my arm, at me with her arms and shirt, and the hug is very warm. Ooh, oh my gosh, already? Oh, Miss Santa, wait, hold up. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. Uh, all right, where do you last see it? Um, it's around here somewhere. That's way too vague. Retrace your steps. What were you doing when you lost it? Well, I was using it to teleport to my workshop, but then a gust of wind came and just blew it out of my hand. My my eyes were closed, so I didn't see where it went. Must be sunk. Must be some kind of professional actor with how into it she is. All right, well, tell me what I should be looking for. A wand, of course, made of pure candy cane. It'll, it'll look different from the usual peppermint ones, though. So she has a candy cane wand. Is she, is she from some kind of magical girl show? A Christmas special? Yeah, you, you're you saying... Yeah, keep... Yeah, Koji. Yeah, a, a Christmas special. Wearing this. Also, I have to say... Woo. Mm -hmm. I have to say, very nice. Also, nice and a little bit. A little bit right there. Take this right there. Right there. Yeah? Sorry, what? Maybe someone thought five second rule and picked it up. Oh, I didn't think of that. She begins scanning the street. Over there is an enormous candy cane, for sure. A small boy is lugging it around. Sinister's running after him. I do too. At this rate, she might fall again. Excuse me? Actually, she doesn't trip as she reaches him. That is in your wand. Huh? Finders keepers, it's mine. <clears throat> it's mine! He clutches it to his chip with a suspicious look. Mama told me I couldn't keep, but it's mine. Go get your own candy cane. How incredibly rude. Yep. Sounding Santa seems unruffled. Was she embarrassed at a moment ago? Hey, does hey that doesn't belong to you, okay? I don't care. It's mine now. Oh gosh, kids. He looks like he's about to cry. Santa kneels down to his height, looking him in the eye. Kano, you can't just run up like that. Kano, do you know, I'm gonna say Kano because I don't want to say the other name and if you know where that universe is. You can't just run off like that. 
Your mother loves you and she knows that you will want that stuffed teddy bear for Christmas. But how does she know his name? Uh, because she's Santa? Huh? Do I know you? Of course I know you, Kano. I know you feel angry right now, but you need to remember, you can still do the right thing. Well, it actually seems like it's working. She's some kind of cat herder. Listen, I know you found it first, but that wallet belongs to me. What should you do with things that don't belong to you? You... you give them back? <laughs> oh my gosh, sorry, I'm more used to... I'm not used to trying to make different voices for different characters. I'm used to doing it for certain characters. It just... It gets me nervous when I try to do new characters for different genres because the girls, it's easy. I've gotten used to the girls and the, first it was the guys, of course. Then I got used to doing the girls and now I need to get used to doing the kids. It's just a little bit hard for me. Sorry. it's I'm shy that way. That's right. That's what a good boy would do. So are you going to be a good boy this year, Kano? Kano? The kid looks down at the giant candy I came in his tiny hands. I can see him tearing up a little bit. I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get mad. I'll, I'll be a good boy, said I promise. She pats him on the head. That's a good boy, Kano. He hands her back, wand back to her. In spite of her apparent clumsiness, she suddenly has the grace of a drum majorette. A uh, major, majorette, there you go. With a, with that candy cane in her hands. Sparkles outline her twirling movement, movements. Is it? It's no. It's no falling from her hands. Hano just looks on in awe. You, you really are Santa. <laughs> He's totally stupefied. I'm probably wearing the same exact expression. Yes, yes, you should because seriously, around the girl just in that, you wouldn't think it'd be Santa, but all of a sudden you start seeing like freaking snow coming out of the hands. Oh, it's Santa. Of course, Kano. Remember, be to be a good for your mother this year. I'll make sure that you get your teddy bear. As long as you promise me that you'll behave, you should return things that don't belong to you, right? You're right, Santa. She sounds so motherly, in spite of your cuteness. Footsteps running faster than the rest of the crowd catch my attention. Oh my gosh, more! Oh, uh, what? There you are, Kano. Concerned mother. I did, uh, she's just a third. She's not going to return, I'm guessing. Yo, Kano, I was so worried about you. His mother, I'm sure Kano looks up to her. I'm sorry, Mama. I didn't want to scare you. She sweeps him up into a hug. I'm sorry, too. Charlie notices us. My son wasn't causing trouble, was he? Not at all. He's a good boy. Good. He is a good boy. Thank you for looking after him. Don't worry about it. Be good, Kano. I'll keep my promise if you do. He nods so rapidly, I wonder if his head will fall off. I promise. And I'll remember. Mother and child walk off hand in hand. I'm just standing there for a moment, trying to process what happened. Yeah, we all tried to process what happened. So, uh, how did you know his name and all that? I told you, I'm Santa. Don't you have a song about this? I'm keeping a list, checking it twice. No, this has to be some elaborate setup. I point without even looking at someone down the street. Who's that? Her name is Tamaka. She wants to see her grandfather for Christmas. Don't you worry, she's been a really good girl this year. I'm about to open my mouth when the girl walks by with a man who must be her father. I heard that your grandfather's getting better, Tamaka. He's going to be able to visit us for Christmas. I can't wait to see him this year. I you can't wait to see you either. I jaw gaze stupidly in amazement. Yep. How can he's to trying to deny it? He's trying to. He's trying. But truthfully, who wouldn't try to deny? Is that kid in the window over there? I just noticed that. But who wouldn't try to deny the fact that this person is able to identify someone? I told you, I'm Santa. I know your name too, Koji. How, how do you know that? I remember everyone's names. But this is in my head. I keep running out of paper, I'd or otherwise. That makes sense. No, but no, it's impossible, right? <laughs> but this girl's face seems, seems so honest if you're. She wouldn't lie. Yes, look at her. She's so adorable. Oh, also, plus, we just dealt with a Katsune. I think he's still having trouble trying to. Tried to accept the fact that he just met a Katsune, a fox girl. I... But there's a problem. Eh, what's that? I don't know, what do you want for Christmas? Mm. Ah, sorry. Children's hearts are open and I can hear their wishes loud and clear. But as the years draw on and people become more careful, more guarded, 
their hearts become close to me. So for helping me, Koji, what would you like Santa to uh, get you for Christmas this year? Uh, but I just stood around. You don't owe me for one for that. No, no, I never would have thought to look for someone taking it. You would have been, you've been a big help. Now Christmas will remain on schedule. So please, tell me what you want for Christmas. She hooks the cane around one of my wrists and clasps my hand, other hand in hers, guiding them to my own chest. Well, oh uh, well. Yes, what is it you want? What I really like is to have people to spend Christmas with. Oh, she's just taken aback by that. You're lonely, aren't you? I can, I can see it. Her eyes stare into me intently. You've always been a good boy, Koji. I remember that. She lets me go, go and withdraws a step, mulling things over. Well, if I work really hard, I should be able to have all of the preparations ready for Christmas early. Yes, that is the clear solution. She looks back to me, smiling brightly. I will spend Christmas with you, Koji. Eh? You, you'll spend Christmas with me? Yes, I'll make sure that you aren't lonely. Now, was it that you lived? Now, was it that you lived? Uh, I moved here recently. Sorry, my brain is still moving around. I have a new apartment. That's right, I know exactly where you are. I'll be sure to visit you sometime this week. Okay, I have to catch up on the preparations, but I'll see you again, Koji. Uh, okay. I'll see you later, Santa. Goodbye, Koji. Soon. See you. I think she said see you soon, but my brain is still muddled for some reason. With that, she vanishes in a puff of snow. I, I don't even know what to make of all this. A foxbird, a child friend, and Santa Claus? Yeah, yeah, basically, yeah, exactly. If you think about it, these are the three uh, undefining, the most rarest of the creatures of the of the uh, protagonist universe. A fox spirit is more common than the child friend. And Santa Claus is the rarest of the ball. If you think about it, child friend, they never end up with the guy. At all. But rarely, unless they're in a harem. And that's a rare thing, even when they're not in a harem. A fox spirit, you see them common, but they usually... You don't, they only spend time with the guy, with the with the person. And Santa Claus, you don't really see Santa Claus gen in anything that much. Where the, the, you got the jackpot here, man. Did everything weird in my life decide to happen on the same day? Yep, all that, yep. Yep, it did. So, what do I want to do now? Fox, Fred, and the Fable all went to, sp went to spend time with me. What's going on here? I was worried about Christmas being lonely. Oh, we're about to get to this point. So, I will So I will explain it by the, at the end of this to tell you what's going to be happening. But now I'm worried about making it out alive. Probably fine, but there's only seven days until Christmas. So that means I only have so much between all of them. Well, they did all kind of say I could spend as much time with them as I want. So I guess I get to decide. But who do I spend the day with? Okay. So, oh, I can't. Okay, I should have say because. Wait, can I go back? No, I can't go back. So I have to make a decision today. So this is actually a very interesting uh, thing here, because for what is that? There is you can act in this game. I'm trying to explain that you actually have three choices to choose from from the very beginning. Three choices of the girls. And what's different about this is that you don't have to skip who's, you don't have to choose like certain things, you have to uh, freaking remember all the routes. Basically, all the routes are here for you. Right here. To just, you know, to do as you want. You don't have to. I wish I could go back. I wish I could go back. Oh, wait, I can actually. Oh, okay, so. Oh, I can't save. Okay, so I'll do it right here. So, yes, yeah, so you, we basically have a choice between three of them. Which means this is going to be a very different soccer series and maybe the longest because I'm actually going to be playing through all three routes here. That's right. This is going to be the one where I go through all three routes. I know that the other ones I didn't go back to because they're just basic one shots. They're ba those routes, they didn't really change the story that much. And plus, it basically just has the same one plus Sakura Spirit, well, Sakura Spirit? No, Sakura Angels. For some reason, I guess I had no choice but to choose the first girl. I don't know why. 
I was trying to get them all. But this one, I don't have to jump through any hoops. I don't have to choose. I don't have to freaking remember the routes. I don't have to do any of that. Now, I actually can choose any of the girls and decide to go through only one time. Like, heck, you can choose them all if you want to. I'm not joking. I remember this one. I remember this one. And I want to let you guys know because we are going to go on this journey together to choose to go through all the routes of these girls. And which means seven for each. Oh my gosh. And we're going to be spending time with all the girls. And it's like I said, it's going to be a long series. So get ready for that, guys. So yeah, that's what I have to explain. Explain. That's, I know. I know. I know. It's weird. I know. But I wanted to do this because... This is like the only soccer game that, as far as I know, that allows me to basically choose a girl in the beginning and choose that route to the very end. And not just try to remember all the routes. That's what I'm trying to say here. But for whatever, I already spent, we're already at the end, so that's about it for today's episode. We'll be back here next time, hopefully tomorrow, unless something changes. Probably tomorrow, hopefully. And we will see... Uh, well, who I chose. Actually, obviously, I know who to choose. But I will let you know who I choose in the beginning next time. But right now, hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know down in the comments below if you, yeah, enjoyed it. Press the bell next to the subscribe button. And to jo uh, join my dark army, press the like uh, bell next to the subscribe button so you'll be notified. Or just come to my channel because YouTube Chan doesn't like this. She doesn't want to announce my channel. So hopefully you guys could do that for me by sharing the video and obviously you can't see this on Twitter because I still don't know if Twitter still has that freaking rule anymore. Whatever. That's about it and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Now for right now, my dark minions. See you next time. Dismissed.